Maine's governor is asking President Bush for a federal disaster declaration in six counties following the ice storm that struck northern New England late last week. Disasters have already been declared in neighboring New Hampshire and nine counties in Massachusetts. In Maine, more than 220,000 power customers are still in the dark. Crews have been working to restore electricity since it first went out early Friday morning. By 10 past 1 in the morning, uh, we knew there was no power. I heard crashes out here, so we knew it wasn't going to be pretty. Power crews have come from Canada, Michigan, and New York. we we'll come down here to try to get some people with the power back on before the holidays so they can enjoy their Christmas. New Hampshire was hardest hit. The ice that coated power lines and trees cut power across a wide swath of the state. High temperatures in the 50s Monday were expected to speed up the melting process. For those still in the dark, relief can't come fast enough. We're very blessed that we have a wood stove so that we're, you know, keeping warm and trying to find extra batteries, but they just told us in here that there's no D batteries in the whole state. But so we'll conserve on our flashlights. In another sign of progress, the Red Cross has 14 shelters that opened over the weekend in New Hampshire have closed as people have been able to go home. 200 schools and businesses in the state, however, remain closed. Matt Friedman, The Associated Press.